Muscle Shoals, a little town in Alabama with a population with just over 13,000. It may be small, but it's known worldwide for its big sounds. All began right here at Fame Studios in Muscle Shoals when in the 1960s Rick Hall began recording his signature sound. Artists like Percy Sledge, Wilson Pickett, and my favorite Aretha Franklin came to Fame Studios with nothing but raw talent and walked out with a hit record. Just south of Muscle Shoals, you'll find the Alabama Music Hall of Fame, where you'll learn about all of the musicians from Alabama. Famous ones, new, young, old, legends, newcomers. There are a lot of them. Once you've been inspired by the past, you can use the museum's recording studio to record your own song. Hit it! Mustang Sally! After recording for years as the house band at Fame Studios, a group of musicians called the Swampers opened a second studio called the Muscle Shoals Sound Studio. It's located right here at the famous location of 3614 Jackson Highway. Well, by that time, their reputation was out, and all the big acts were coming to them. Elton John, Rolling Stones, Leonard Skinner, all of them, they came here to record. And that's why in the 60s and 70s, Muscle Shoals was called the hit record capital of the world. One thing I've learned on this Southern journey, no matter what your musical taste, Alabama artists have probably been influencing it for decades. And there's no better place to find out more about it than right here in Muscle Shoals. So till next time, see you later. to you by U.S. Gulf Coast State's Geotourism.